Hey, how's it going folks? E.T. here with another iMovie tutorial. This tutorial is how to clean up a bunch of room on your hard drive. But before we get started, big disclaimer here, back up everything before you do this if you want it. If you don't want it, then don't back it up. But highly, highly, highly suggest backing up your videos before doing what I'm going to show you. Okay, so what I have here is I have a bunch of projects here. And I label them delete one through five. And then I have a, another one here for newest vlog November. So what you're going to do is go to your finder. And you're looking for the movies item here in the left side. And what you're going to do is right click on this iMovie library file right here. You're going to go to show package contents. And what you see here. Let me shrink this a little bit so we can kind of have a good look at what we need is we have all of our projects. We have one through five, and then we have that new, newest vlog November right here. Okay, so what you're gonna do, again, please back everything up before you do this so you don't lose any of your footage. But before I delete anything, let's go ahead and look in one of these. So inside of this, they're gonna have transcoded media, shared items, rendered files, original media, et cetera, et cetera. So that's a lot of information that's being stored in these files. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna delete all these. But before you do that, go ahead and close iMovie. Okay, so here we go. I'm deleting everything except for that newest one, okay? Let's go ahead and highlight all these. Right click, move to trash. Then I'm gonna close that finder. Go to the trash can and I'm gonna empty. Okay, and iMovie must be closed or it's gonna give you some warning message, so make sure it's closed. So now we're going to go ahead and open up iMovie. And you're going to get a message asking you if you want to continue or repair. Go ahead and select repair. So now all of those projects are actually gone. And that's all the original files, the render files, everything. So it'll clear up a lot of space on your drive. Okay, again, thanks for watching. And third disclaimer here, back up your content. Back up your original video. The way I do it is on the SD card, as soon as I put it in my computer, I drag it to an external drive and save the original there. After I've done my editing and it's all ready to go and I export it, I export it to my desktop and then I save a copy of that on an external drive. Okay, so I have the original footage untouched and I have the final product, you know, fully edited and exported. And that's just the way I do it. There's other ways to do it, of course, but back up your data before you lose it, trust me. We'll see you next time. Peace and aloha.